Sat, this is his lordship. Live and direct. You see the little cycle right there? Yeah. That's the cycle. It is not a segue. It's a one wheel. It's an electric unicycle. Segways are nice. Too bad the owner got killed on the Segway. The, the guy who owned the Segway killed himself on the Segway. But this is a one wheel. It's very adventurous and way more dangerous than the Segway. So anyway, I usually set this thing to follow me, but I left the tripods, the tri, the legs to the gimbal. I left them at home, so I'm gonna have to freestyle it. I'm gonna have to use my extra cinematic cinematographer skills. Yeah, so I got the Segway parked on the ramp, and I just want to say for you younger folks, take it from a man who has lived at least a half a century all right so i have the ability to see you know flaws you know i have the ability to see bullshit i have the ability to see the quarterback sneak you know and you know all my life i've always been focused on what I always been trying to do and all what I always wanted to do and I never ever let that uh anything interfere with that I didn't let my freedom interfere with that I didn't have children at a young age so it wouldn't interfere with that I made sure I didn't owe no child support so I wouldn't be restricted to America you know I made sure a lot of things not to judge anybody but I'm just saying that you know, when you mess with somebody of my years and experience and the stuff I've been through, you know what I'm saying? I just sit up there and just like, whoa, you know, like I see, I see all. I know, I don't know all, but it's like I've been there, you know what I'm saying? Like I've lived in such, so many different situations and environments and different things that happen to me throughout my life. It's like, like nothing is beyond me not peeping game, you know? And nothing is gonna knock me off my square. I'm always gonna do what I do. You know, like I got teary-eyed when Sun Ra was brought on stage to play his music. He was so sick, he was on a gurney. He could only stick one arm off the gurney and play the piano. I said, that's what I'm talking about. Um, Jay Dilla had his sampler in the hospital room. Jay Dilla is in, in bed dying. They help him over to the chair so he can work on another beat right before he died. That's what I'm talking about. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Sammy Davis Jr. got called out. He'd been in the bed three months. He got throat cancer. Gregory Hines called Sammy Davis Jr. out. He went out there after three months of being in the, in the bed and gave it one last tap. That's what I'm talking about. You see, it's, it's what matters to you the most. People got to get to know you. If they want to be a part of your world, they need to get to know you and what your mission has been and know that you can't be distracted. You see what I'm saying? Because one thing has never lied on you, cheated on you, never let you down, never turned their back on you. And that's the things that you kept in your life from day one and the things that you desired from day one. So my history was show since the age of six, I knew I wanted to be an artist. It didn't matter if I was famous or not, I just wanted to be an artist. Okay, at the age of six, I wasn't thinking about money, all right? So anyway, Lordship, out, stay cool, and uh, catch you next time.